Nationalist Serbs burned the Croatian flag exactly 20 years after Zagreb's four-day military offensive known as Operation Storm in what Belgrade describes as the biggest ethnic cleansing since World War II. Police reinforcements were deployed outside the Croatian embassy on Wednesday. Protesters angry all these years on over the forced mass exodus of Serbian civilians and the consequent looting that had scarred relations between the two countries for years. The leader of the Serbian Radical Party led the protest. He said, and what Croats did, they expelled the whole Serbian population and those who did not want to leave were killed. More than 220,000 Serbs were expelled and a few thousand killed, mostly women, children and old people. The anniversary was marked by a candle-lit vigil and critical remarks from politicians, a reminder of long-lasting tensions in the region, despite recent diplomatic peacemaking efforts from all sides. Meanwhile, the day before in Croatia, a contrasting scene, a military parade, some 3,000 soldiers and 300 vehicles featured to the delight of many Croatians, including current president Kolinda Gabra Kitrović. In August 1995, Croatia's army launched a pre-dawn offensive on the self-proclaimed Krajina Republic, a territory bordering Bosnia and Herzegovina, held by ethnic Serb rebels since 1991, when they opposed Zagreb's drive for independence from Yugoslavia.